Hey, good morning, guys. It's Krista. It's May 6th, Monday, and I just wanted to pop on here and share another ministry idea with you guys, and I hope that this video can also um, be a source of encouragement to you today. Um, I had a girls' night out last night with some friends um, from our young marrieds group at my um, congregation, and we all have got little kids and multiple little kids. So I wanted to do something special for them um, in honor of Mother's Day, which is just around the corner. And I came up with these little goodie bags. And um, I can't, unfortunately, mail one to every one of my subscribers. I would love to. But um, I thought maybe I could just share it with you via a video. And you can pass on this idea if you want to use it to um, minister to moms in your community. So what I did is I just got little um, bags from the dollar store and some tissue paper and I put together um, these little mommy survival kits so I just um, took a quart size Ziploc bag and um, made some labels and this is like a little red cross symbol that I put on um, either side of the lettering and they're pink so it's cute and girly but I wanted to share with you um, what's inside this bag and what uh, what each item represents. Um, along with this, I put um, a little letter explaining everything. So I'm just going to go through that with you real quick. Um, I hope you guys find this encouraging too as I share it with you. So I'm going to dump it out. And tell you what each one represents. So there's some pretty funny random things in here. But I think you'll get a kick out of this. So the first thing I included in the mom survival kit is a rubber band. To remind you, flexibility is key. And then I put a scripture for each item. And the scripture for the rubber band is, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways submit to Him, and He will make your path straight. Proverbs 3, verses 5 through 6. Um, and the next thing that I included in the mommy survival kit is... Um, a few marbles, <laughs> in case you feel like you've lost all of your own. Um, for God has not given us a spirit of fear, but a power of love and a sound mind, 2 Timothy 1.5. Um, I also included a little paper clip to help you keep it all together. Um, but, all, but all things should be done decently and in order, 1 Corinthians 14.40. Um, I also included a toothpick. Um, to pick out the good qualities in others and ourselves. For the Lord sees not as man sees. For the Lord looks on the outward appearance. Or for the man, for man looks on the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. First Samuel 16, verse 7. Um, I also included a jumbo eraser to remind you that every mom makes mistakes. Above all, keep loving one another earnestly, since love covers a multitude of sins. First Peter 4, 8. And then I just included a pen and a little notepad to list uh, our blessings. Behold, I set before you this day a blessing and a curse. The blessing, if you obey the commandments of the Lord, your God, which I command you this day. Deuteronomy 11, 26 through 27. I included a little travel pack of tissue to dry those tears, yours and the children's. For the lamb, is, uh, for the lamb in the midst of the throne will be their shepherd, and he will guide them to springs of living water, and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. Revelation 7.17 hmm. Then I also included a little uh, two-year mini calendar uh, to remind you that time will pass too quickly, so enjoy every moment. Teach us to number our days that we may gain a heart of wisdom. Psalms 90 verse 12 um, I also included a little jewel to remind you that you are valuable. Um, who can find a virtuous woman for her price is far above ruby, rubies? Proverbs 31, verse 10. Um, I've also included a little box of matches for when you feel burnt out. Um, let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father which is in heaven. Matthew 5, 16. A puzzle piece because you are an important piece in your child's journey through life. Train up a child in the way he should go and when he is old he will not depart from it. Proverbs 22, verse 6. Um, and this is one of my favorite things. Um, I just included a pair of googly eyes for the extra set on the back of your head that you that every mom needs. 
Um, she watches over the affairs of her household and does not eat the bread of idleness. Proverbs 31, verse 27. And then um, in each pack, I included a couple of uh, Hershey's hugs and kisses, the little candies, for when you give all of yours away and you need some back. The eternal God is your refuge, and his everlasting arms are under you. Deuteronomy 33, verse 27. A pack of gum to help you uh, remember to stick to it. Um, and the verse I picked for that was Galatians 6, 9. Let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we'll reap the harvest if we do not give up. And then um, a pack of Smarties for the days when you don't feel too smart. For the law of the Lord is perfect, reviving the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise the simple. Psalms uh, 19, verse 7. And then I've got uh, a Band-Aid for when things get a little rough. <laughs> um, he heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds. Wounds, uh, Psalms 147, verse 3. Included a battery in my little mom's survival kit to give you that extra charge to keep you going and going. And I have two verses for this one. Um, Never be lacking in zeal, but keep your spiritual uh, fervor serving the Lord. Romans 12, verse 11. And then Isaiah 40, verses 29 through 31. He gives strength to the weary and increases the power of the weak. Even youths grow tired and weary, and young ones stumble and fall. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles, and they will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. Then um, I just included a little piece of twine or rope for when you reach the end of yours. This will help you keep going a little bit longer. Um, a threefold cord is not quickly broken, Ecclesiastes 4.12. And he is before all things, and in him all things hold together. Colossians 1, uh, verse 17. And then I included a small, smooth stone to remind you that rough times help to refine and polish you. Um, and I will put this third into the fire and refine them as one refined silver and test them as gold is tested. They will call upon my name and I will answer them. I will say, these are my people, and they will say, the Lord is my God. Uh, Zechariah 13, verse 9. And then I just included a pair of vinyl gloves um, for those times when you need an extra pair of hands. And the verse is Psalms uh, 119.48. I will lift up my hands toward your commandments, which I love, and I will med meditate on your statutes. And then almost done here, I've got um, a little mini Snickers bar um, to remind you to laugh. And the verse I chose was um, Psalm 16, verse 11. You make known to me the path of life. In your presence there is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. And then the last thing I included is a little tea bag to remind you to relax. Come to me, all who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Matthew eleven twenty-eight. 28. So I included all those little items. Um, and some of them are just silly. They're just for fun. But um, I hope that uh, I gave these little goodie bags out last night at our get-together. Get and I hope that this really encouraged my friends. And I hope that this encourages you um, via this video, even though I can't, unfortunately, mail one out to everyone who ends up watching this video, um, and pass on this idea. I think um, I would I would love to receive something like this, so I put a lot of thought into like collecting which um, items and verses. So anyway, I will put um, all of those items and the verses in the description below in case you guys want to pass on this little uh, Mother's Day gift idea. And then I also, I have a little laminating machine, and um, I will also put the links to these below, but I included these little, um, they're kind of thicker than bookmarks, but I figured if my friends wanted to, they'd keep them in their Bibles, or um, you can even put a magnet on the back and put them on your refrigerator. Okay, so here are the other things that I included in that little gift bag for my friends. Um, the first thing is the ABCs of Good Moms, um, and I got this from imom.com. Or do you want to be part of this? Here we go. Okay. Then I also have 10 things that moms can be thankful for. I also printed this from imoms.com. Oh, you're watching Twinkle Twinkle? And then I have 31. Uh, <laughs> then I also have 31 days of prayer for your children. And I got this um, from a blog. So I will um, remember to leave all the links below for that. And then I just had a handwritten letter to um, each of my friends. And um, I just left this one generic so I can read it to you guys. Hello. 
Okay, so. I love it. <laughs> Dear friend, I hope you have a great Mother's Day. You are awesome. My prayer for you this Mother's Day is that you would have a renewed sense of purpose, passion, and joy in your journey as a mom. I also pray that we would both have a heart like Mary to pursue our master in the midst of our busy lives and demanding schedules. I pray that even in the trenches, our hearts would return to God, the source of our strength and salvation. And then I included Hello. a few different quotes. Hi. Um, so here we go. Motherhood is not a hobby. It is a calling. It's not something to do if you can squeeze time in. It's what God gave you time for. Your, chil your children will become who you are, so be who you want them to be. But um, I get wet. Yeah. Relish the charms of the present. Enjoy today, Mama. It will be over before you know it. May our children become righteous ones, our sons as Ephraim and Manasseh, our daughters as Sarah, Rebecca, Ma Rachel, and Leah. Mommy. You're great, Mom. Love, Krista. So that's what um, I included in my little Mommy. letter. Yes, it will be. Anyway, I hope you guys um, like this little idea. I hope it was encouraging to you. And um, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.